Here's another example. Mount Everest is getting taller at a rate of about 6.1 centimeters per year. That's two or three inches taller per year. And that's because the motion of the currents in the mantle underneath are causing geological uplift in that region. So these Himalaya mountains, which are already the tallest in the world by a wide margin, are actually getting taller every year. The question here is, how much taller is it today than it was when Edmund Hillary first climbed it in 1953? Well, today, as I'm sitting here recording, this is 2008. So if we do 2008 minus 1,953, we get 55 years. So that was 55 years ago when Edmund Hillary first climbed Mount Everest. Now we want to know how much taller it, it is now. So we're looking for the distance. How much has it grown in that time? Well, at a speed of 6.1 centimeters per year, I know distance is speed times time. So I'll put in the 6.1 centimeters per year for the speed. 6.1 centimeters per year. And I multiply that by the time. And it's been growing for 55 years since Hillary climbed it. So times 55 years. And mathematically, again, this years is like having years over 1. So it's in the numerator. It cancels out with the years down there. And that leaves us with centimeters for our distance. So 6.1 times 55, that comes out to 335.5. And as we said, that's in centimeters. So that's how much taller it is than it was when it was first climbed by Edmund Hillary. So that's our answer. We might want to convert that, though. That's That would be, if we move the decimal two places to the left, we get... 3.355 meters, which is really close to 11 feet. So the people who climb it today have to climb a little bit higher than Edmund Hillary when he climbed it.